what's going on, Republican brothers and sisters? Big Dick, Dickhead, your Republican big boss man. I want to talk about that, eh? them angry, lily-loving liberals up there in Wisconsin. And they're angry at their conservative legislators for cutting back on collective bargaining rights for unions, for working on controlling on controlling costs. Because the state is going broke. Well, of course the state's going broke. They've been giving away the biggest tax breaks in history to the corporations in that state. And rich individuals, they need to get some revenue. The best way to do that is to go after working people. The best way to do that is to pass legislation to make sure they're not making as much money so they can't spend as much money. So they, the merchants don't have as much money to pay in taxes and income, and income taxes. Wait a minute. That don't make sense. Well, never mind. The point is, the Republican legislators are up there and they're doing something. And if they cut the costs of their employees by cutting back on collective bargaining to the unions, then they're making more money. That way, they can pay them scab stripe breaking union busting laborers to come in and do them jobs so they can make more money. Don't you know? It's a new economy, America, where slave labor comes from all over the world. We got all kinds of them just waiting to fill them jobs. We got illegal immigrants. We got teenagers that can't afford to go to college. They're just waiting to take those dang former unionized jobs and low-paying part-time jobs. We don't give the corporations what they want, what we want. If they don't give us what we want, them legislators know that we'll just take our companies and hightail it out of town. We ain't just going to tell that town, we're going to leave the whole country and take them jobs with us. Ain't no more cake, ain't no more loaf of bread, America. It's down to cookies and crumbs, fortune cookies. If you don't play our game, you ain't going to have no good fortune. So yeehaw, you go, Republican legislators up there in Wisconsin and everywhere else in the country. You just keep cutting and slashing, going after those big wage earners. And never mind, there won't be no more money in the state to buy anything to stimulate the local economies. There's billionaires and millionaires. They own corporations. They own all kinds of property. They might even stay in your podunk little frozen tundra frozen state you call Wisconsin wherever. They'll pay their property taxes. They ain't got no choice there. As for union busting, you can go strike in hell, you little loving tree huggers. Go see how much Mother Nature pays. I'm dickhead, and you ain't. In fact, you ain't even rich enough to be a Republican.